Down on your left, 19 with the puck right now. He is an absolute dervish. And he likes to do that, likes to wrap around, lets it go. And there's not much more to say. Yeah, it's he's like sitting. he finished my sentence. Continuing the battle right in front, the big fella. And now right there, tic-tac-toe, and what a pass! Oh, my goodness! Meechkov gets the goal, but the setup was absolutely spectacular. Solid game. And yet another goal for Meechkov. And here's Meechkov again. Looking, 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 setting it up, following up. Another opportunity and another goal for the man who just turned 15. And here's that man again behind the net, tries to jam it in. We've seen him do that on so many social media clips. He expects to be able to work his way in just like that. It's an excellent play. The Canadian keeper thinks that he's got the measure of him, but you see how quick his hands are, and what a reaction from the Russians as they run down their bench. That is slotted in as quick as you can see it. Mishkov knows exactly what he's trying to achieve, and he executes it with perfection. Right through the five hole, you could see he looked and he knew it. And that is his signature celebration. One knee and a, a fist pump. This is still not the Russians' top power play unit, but doesn't matter. And there he is again. There he is again. He is a goal-scoring genius. He's done it throughout every level. And you're waiting. You're saying, OK, he's at the next level. But we're talking about Matvey Michkov. The two players I've been talking about, Savoy and Fantili, and Fantili just took that one. Power play Russia, not what Canada needs. And there's the sniper, 19, and somehow it manages its way in, and Vachko right in the middle of it. I, I believe that uh, Mich. Michkov will get an assist there. Well, at the remarkable physical play, uh, you better be airtight and dead on with it and pure with it. Or otherwise, if there's any uh, side parts or missing parts or loose parts, you're in trouble. Talk about loose parts. There's a, a sweet assist from Michkov, and he comes in for the hug, and you could see the appreciative teammate Gazizov pointing immediately at the 15-year-old. The goal, right on goal, good save, couldn't clear. Now Michkov, so confident with the puck. Here he goes again and gets another goal and gives us the little bow and arrow, somewhat muted. Yep, I mean, uh, it's a great goal. It, the reason I, I think it's a great goal is because he not only slides across uh, with such speed, He's actually kind of doing a T-push here, so he's ready. He receives this. It's the no-look pass from Kovojko, but he's doing a T-push. He opens up. He rotates. He takes the first shot, but the quickness in which to find the rebound back available again and then slot it through the opening on Leninin is uh, it's what he does best. And I find it fascinating watching him work from there because I can't think of a comparable player in how he finds his angles and how he opens up his lanes in the National Hockey League at the moment. Yeah, he's very strong in the puck, and he'll go in the dirty areas to go get it. Michkov right there. Now, Roshnichenko, and they center her up, and what a, an opportunity for the Russians to get poised and get under control. Look at Michkov walks in, and there he is! Oh, what a goal from Michkov as he comes through the high slot area. Do not give him a second invitation because he'll accept the first one. And he, with a quick rocket of a shot, reaches Silverstein and it squeezes through the five hole. And what a power play start for the big machine. Tournament record in
pace everybody's expecting. You're watching a future superstar.